Oh, this is our YouTube uh, scripter tool that we've made. You might have a bit of fun with it, even if you don't really need any YouTube scripts for work or anything like that. Um, I'm just going to start it off. It's a menu at the top. You, you can't quite see it there. It's, um, it just says GPT menu. Um, what you do is get the settings on the left, similar to the social media tool that we've made. So you put in the kind of type of video you want. So we've tested it with a few different things. This one, just for fun, I've just put in as a debate between Richard Dawkins and Pope Francis, but you can put, for example, um, educational video, explainer videos, things like that, and you can just put the description of the person down as a narrator, or you can you know, put in detailed descriptions of a few different people that are having a conversation within the video and things like that. Um, so, or you can leave these blank if they're not relevant to your video. And then there you put in a topic. You can just put the word anything like five times if you want to, and then it'll do you know, five different ideas for you. And um, does a title for the video. And then um, depending on how many minutes you say you want the video to be, it does kind of a scene for every two minutes of the video. Um, again, these are just ideas. You want to use them. So it's come with four different scenes um, for an eight minute video. And then it comes up with the plan, and then it turns the plan into a script for you. Um, so with all these tools, you can kind of pause them at any point. So I can say cancel um, and I can go and change the plan if I want to. And then I can resume it um, from the GPT menu. So GPT send request um, and it will just carry on using my amended version instead. So that's a way you can kind of get better outputs if it's along the right tracks. Um, you can also go and just delete one and get it to run it again. It just kind of fills in the blanks. So again, if you're not sure on the scene, just and um, get it to remake that for you and um, so yeah it'll do the plan it takes a little bit longer on the script it'll do the script and uh, come up with an idea for a thumbnail as well and it will have a go draw and that the, the pictures aren't always great from dolly and um, it probably would draw this one it's they're very sensitive about drawing anything about the pope at the moment <laughs> after all the ai pictures that we released it usually refuses to draw that particular one but you, you can edit the description yourself and um, so yeah here's our script as you can see Decent length, so that's should be about eight minutes worth, possibly. And uh, we've got, I think we went for assumed it would be about 160 words a minute of kind of conversation needed. Um, yeah, I'll leave that running to show you. We've also got a little extra tab here, which is topic suggestions. Um, so you, well, that's just an old one that's in there. And um, so I'll come on it now because it's one of the other script, but. Yeah, you put in what you want and it'll give you 20 ideas for topics and any that you like, uh, just, just pull them across and you paste them into here and run it. Um, so, so to get a copy of this, like with all our tools, we haven't used one before, you click File in the top left. You can't see it here, but File, you can see some of it, and make a copy. Uh, that will copy the sheet across to your own Google Drive, so whatever Google account you logged into at the time, um, it'll copy it into that Google account. And then you follow these instructions. So file and make a copy. Um, if you haven't got an API key yet, um, register with OpenAI and get your API key. Um, they'll give you $18 free credit. If you registered a while ago, the free credit might have expired, in which case you might have to sign up for API credit. Uh, but it uses a Turbo model, which is very, very cheap. $20 is like 7 million words or something crazy. Um, so once you've signed up and you've got your API key, um, sticky key in this square here. Now you won't be able to see the key. We've just done like a um, blue text or a blue background. That's just for security of anyone because it's, it's like a password type thing. Um, yeah, and then you fill in the settings and, and let it run. Um, let's have a look how far I got here. Oh, you get it's drawn. Uh, yeah, it just said two opposing figures. It didn't mention the Pope, so it's been okay to draw it. Um, again, there are two faces. Because it's a debate. Um, so there you go. That, that's that. Um, yeah, don't think there's much else you need to know. Really, that, that's pretty much it. I hope you find it useful, or at least a bit of fun, if, if it's it's not something you really need for work. But uh, yeah, thank you. Enjoy.